just about it. Once that shed's built, it's gonna be so much easier. Whoa! Choi. I could technically make them nightly chores, but uh, I don't want to run those risks. I mean, if I make them nightly chores, then uh, there's always that chance they might not get done properly. I think I'll give them the normal pumpkin, keep the special pumpkin myself, because uh, there may be a pumpkin contest. I don't know. Interestingly enough, for the record, I don't look anything up about this game. Um, the, one of the things I like about uh, playing video games is the actual experience and the joy I get from just learning. Weirdly enough. Hello, Bweep. Hello, Bweep. For the egg, hello, Bwok. Nice shit fuck. I really should say different things when I get surprised. I really should. As, uh... Christ shit fuck gets weird. Sell the silver. Two gold eggs. Pretty. Anyways, carving pumpkins. Bring Caroline a pumpkin. Okay, Caroline, let's get you your pumpkin. And, uh, yeah, once that shed's made, I'll make a bunch of jammers or whatever the fuck you want to call her. Uh, I call them fermenting barrels. And, uh, start fermenting a bunch of stuff. E. I think this is Caroline's house. Um, no. no, this is Jody's house. Okay, Caroline's house is probably next door then. Wait, which one is Caroline? Oh, green hair girl. Okay. Yeah, hers I think is next door. That's hers. And Emily, I believe, lives there too. Oh well, let's see if we can find Caroline. Does she live in here? Okay. Huh. 
Huh. Oh, where do you live, Caroline? That's definitely not someone's room. That's Gus's room. Mr. Gus apparently lives here. Oh, where, oh, where is a Caroline? Is a Caroline? Where is Caroline? There is Caroline. There is Caroline. Paul's Abby's favorite season, so I'm hoping she'll come out of her room more often. Oh, the pumpkin! It's been a good one. Or it's a good one. Abigail will be happy when she sees this. Thanks, Kit. That was an easy 500. I played a wild mushrooms and eggs for breakfast today. I'm still full. <laughs> oh, of course you are. Anyways, let's see if I can uh, go pick up some recipes, shall we? Let's see if there aren't any that are too, uh, too expensive. Mackie roll recipe. There we go. He. Now let's go see about making some maki rolls, because I know one person loves... Well, one person in particular loves sushi. So why not bring him sushi? I mean, I'm fish enough. Why not bring him sushi once uh, once, uh, once or twice a week? Sorry, itchy leg. So, let's see. We need seaweed. Fish. Didn't even know I had these. Roots platter. Oh, I need rice. Okay. So I still have to go this way anyways. Because I do need I do need to buy myself some rice. Hopefully rice isn't too expensive. I think it's like 50 or 100 or something. Something along those lines. Here's hoping. Oh, I missed the music. I so missed the music for this game. Jesus, rice is 200. Let's drop 2,000 on 10 things of rice. That's uh, five weeks worth of Mackey rolls for him. And it's worth it. It is worth it for the love of my character's life. Hi! Kind of like I would do anything for the love of my life. Glittering boulder removed. Hey, three crab pots. Ah. 
I thought one of these required an eel. That is cute. That is just so cute. Those little spirits are just adorable. Okay. All right. I need to drop off a couple more things. I forgot about that. I need to come down over here. I need to drop off the rock carrot, finally. Which means in one year, or rather in one more month, I'll have this finished. With any luck. Autumn's Bounty. Yummy. Hi, little spirit guy. Come on. Come on, you can do it. It'll take you a little while, but you can do it. <laughs> Thankfully, time doesn't seem to pass as fast in here, weirdly enough. But oh well, apparently an eel isn't required. Weird. I actually really thought it was. Anyways, I'm gonna go and since I'm using traps. I'm gonna start keeping bait on me since I've got more traps now. Um I'm gonna start keeping bait on me as a made as a major part of like or as a normal part of what I carry. Let's make some bait really quick. That'll be enough bait for a while. There we go. I need to make two more of those later. Just to fill that entire little area. I probably should deposit my maple tapper somewhere, or just my tapper somewhere. I need to start something with that, or do something with that. But uh, in winter, I'm gonna remodel. Um, I'm gonna remodel my farm a little. Anyways, let's put you in here. I need either of you for a little while. I'm going to put the pumpkin in here. Reduce all those fish down into Mackie Rolls. 
Pop my seaweed in here. Oysters. And you know what? Oh, it's a small chicken trophy. That's a small one. Anyways, preserving bins, woodstone and coal. <clears throat> I'm also gonna move these out of my house so I can actually get some furniture in here. But uh, yeah. Anyways, let's call it a early night tonight. Did I actually, uh... Yeah, I sold some things today. So let's see how much I got today. Some tells me this is going to be a cheap day. Anyways, let's see what we got. Oh, forgot I had a minor harvest. Ah, so 1,380, so not bad. Not bad at all. Anyways. Oh, sorry about the stretch. Actually, I'm not. Anyways. So, hopefully our shed will be done within a couple days, but anyways. For now, this is Kit the Solus signing off. So, until next time, everybody. Bye-bye!